Hey Fight World, hey Fight World, how, how are you all doing? I'm back, back with another one, it's been a, a little while uh, since, I, since I made a video, about a week I believe, or, or, or around about there, around about a week. Not a lot, the reason being is uh, of course not a lot has been happening. Um, obviously with the situation that we are still in and still waiting on news of when things will be uh, back to normal, when uh, life will well, uh, life will have some normality back there. Uh, but anyway, besides that, so not not a lot, of, you know, not a great deal of things happening. Um, still, still watching classics, still watching the, the legendary fights, um, watching YouTube, a lot of YouTube, and uh, liking some videos. You know, I'm enjoying some people's channels and others not so much. I won't mention names, but uh, you know, I, I think what happens is, you know, you you, you subscribe to a channel. You follow a, a certain person, uh, whether it doesn't just have to be boxing, it can be whatever, anything, basketball, football, baseball, anything, anything, whatever it is. Um, and you kind of, you know, you, you enjoy, you know, for like the channel you watch, you enjoy the, the, the person's content. And I think you kind of, you know, you, you kind of outgrow them in a way or they just become, you, you, you kind of get tired of, you, know, you, you get tired of the, the, the videos or whatever kind of thing. That's At least that's what happens with me. Um, and I'm finding that uh, I don't know if it's because of my own frustration of the way things are, but uh, some some people are certainly uh, you know really really starting to to annoy me with it with their content or that you know some people have egos you know you know what I'm saying egos yeah some people have egos and you know wear fucking glasses anyway so yeah but there's a lot of, listen a lot of great content a lot of a lot of fantastic a lot of fantastic content uh, out on YouTube and. Uh, you know, I do respect a, a, a few, you know, the channels that do good content and, and, but listen, if you, I mean, it's not up to me or up to you how people run their channels and stuff like that, but just stick to what you do, you know what I mean? Don't, I mean, even myself, I can go off topic sometimes. Um, I suppose, I guess anybody can. I don't write anything down. I don't have notes or anything. I just say what, whatever, I, what I, whatever I'm thinking, I say, you know what I mean? I don't have notes or I just say what I want to, I talk about what I want to talk about and, I, and but what I'm saying is, so some people's channels they just go off topic completely you know and like i say egos you know drop the drop the ego no need to have it you know i, I don't i don't you know no need no need to wear shades on every video and stuff like that but they, listen that's that this is anyway so pretty much the only thing that that the that i'm really hearing kind of um on a big scale of, of the news and the boxing news and stuff like that is that i'm hearing um of course, that Mike Tyson's gonna, you know, accept the offer for the uh, the, the, the bare knuckle the bare knuckle challenge, the bare knuckle boxing uh, with uh, of course Shannon Shannon Briggs, big Shannon, you know. Uh, I made a video about, I made a video on this. I made a video about um, I made a video about Mike Tyson returning returning to the ring and saying I don't think it's a great idea. Um, but of course, let the legendary listen, the legendary Iron Mike Tyson, one of the scare, you know, one of the most dominant one of the you know he had beaten most guys before they even got in the ring they were intimidated by the by him they, you know there's there's only one iron mike tyson but this is a this this version of mike tyson is obviously a, a lot older um a lot way past his prime and all that kind of stuff but i, I heard that the, the the figure was uh was 20 million dollars or something uh, uh, you know along those lines something around about 20 mil 20 mil you know so i can't blame him for taking the fight but i i, I don't know i mean obviously him uh, Mike Tyson and Shannon Briggs are, are, are you know, getting up there in, in age. Uh, it would, it would sell. It will sell if, if it, you know, it goes ahead, which it, it seems it's going to go ahead. It will sell, of course. It's Iron Mike, even even at this advanced age that he's at now, it will, you know, it will sell, and uh, people, I guess, will enjoy it. And, and I will, I will watch it. I will watch it. But I just think it, it, at this point, it's just a money thing. Maybe it's not though. Maybe it's for the challenge. Maybe Mike uh, and Shannon as well. Of course, uh, he's more been. A lot more active over these recent years uh, has Shannon over 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 Iron Mike. I think I also heard or read somewhere as well when I was, uh, you know, doing research and stuff like that. Um, I heard that uh, Ivanda is is uh, also coming back, and there was talks of um, there was talks of the uh, Conor, Conor McGregor and uh, Oscar Oscar De La Hoya. I don't know how you know how uh, how true that is that they're, they're going to get it on and they're going to get it on. But listen, they, you know. These guys want to come back. It's 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 you know most of it's money, you know money related because of the the, the you know the massive amounts of money 
especially even the Conor McGregor thing. Look at the Floyd, the Floyd Mayweather fight that uh, Conor, when Floyd fought Conor McGregor, the money was enormous, right? The money was huge, you know. So you can't blame these guys for for, for wanting to get, you know, get these dollars, you know, get these dollars, and uh, you only live once, and I understand that. But I, uh, you know, and I watched it. Uh, I seen on Sky Sports. It was, I believe, yes, yeah, yeah, it was. Sky Sports, I've seen the uh, Anthony Joshua uh, interview with, uh, I don't remember the the, the, uh, the lady's name, but she's a, uh, she's a boxing, you know, boxing journalist in the UK. Can't, can't recall her name right now, but, um, you know, Anthony Joshua, the, you know, I've talked about him as a fighter, I'm not going to get into all that again as a boxer, I do think he's good, but um, just, I want to just talk a second, but just on personality, I know this is, you know, obviously this isn't related to, to, the, to him as a boxer, as a, a physical fighter. But he's just you, when you when you see the likes of uh, the likes of Tyson Fury and uh, Deontay Wilder and um, these big guys, they have tons of personality. You know, D- does Fury and uh, Wilder? They have a lot of a lot of personality and uh, they, they shine. You know, you see that when you watch the uh, the face-offs and things like that, you, they really do shine. And, and Tyson Fury, I think, has a you know he has a huge a huge personality. Lo- he tons of charisma. So as does Wilder. But especially Fury has a ton of charisma, and Joshua just does not have it. He just does not have it. He has no charisma. You know, you listen to him. He's, he's you know, he, I've mentioned it, mentioned this previously, but he crosses it was quite quick, and, and, and to me, at least, anyway, it's up to you guys what you what you think your opinion is is is, is, is up to you. That's fair enough. But um, he just he he doesn't have the personality. You know, when he gets it, when he does get it on, right? When he gets it on with um, Wilder. Or Fury, or hopefully when, when he does fight them both, eventually, of course, yeah. Um, the face-offs are going to be quite one-sided because you know you, you guys know what Fury's like in press conferences and, 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 and face-offs, and you know his charisma. He just oozes charisma. He really does. Does Tyson Fury? Uh, Wilder has a lot of it too, but Joshua just does not have it. He just doesn't have the charisma. You know, maybe some people out there, maybe I think he's just a boring. You know, he's a boring. As a, as a personality, he's just a boring person. I really do find him boring and you know mundane. And, but um, I'm not here to bash. You know, I'm not here to bash people though. But that's that is my opinion. I just think that he, that that they they're going to be quite one sided when they do fight. Hopefully they do. I can't wait for that. I can't wait for the uh, these massive these massive heavyweight matchups. Right? I can't wait for these massive heavyweight matchups. Um, as well as other stuff. As well as everything else. All all the different all different weight classes and. Uh, you know, UFC, of course, is and uh, always great. You know, big. I'm a big UFC fan. You know, I'm more of a boxing fan, but UFC is cool. You know, UFC is definitely, definitely dope, and uh, de- uh, you know, tremendous amount of skill in the sport of uh, mixed mixed martial arts MMA. But uh, it's uh, yeah, it's tough. It was supposed to be um, the the uh, Dillian White Povetkin fight was supposed to be uh, tonight. Actually, it was scheduled for tonight, but obviously with the uh, with the big C, it's uh, it, that's off. So you know, it's it's tough. It's tough. But I, honestly, I do. I recommend. You know, I really do recommend to you guys. Um, we've all got time. You know, nobody can say they haven't got time to do A, B, and C. Every we all have time. Go and watch some classics. You know, watch some classic fights. Watch some some legendary uh, fights. Whoever you want to pick. Uh, there's so many out there. You know, the beauty of today is with YouTube and uh, obviously you, you know your, your ESPN apps and, and, and in Britain you. you of course, we have ESPN, but Sky Sports and, and BT Sport and all that kind of stuff. Access to a ton of material, a ton of fights, and uh, you know we should, you know, take the time and just enjoy it. Uh, enjoy the fights and uh, let you know teach. I learn every day, you know, I really do. I learn every day watching, <clears throat> watching boxing and, and watching classic um, NBA. I've mentioned before my my thing. I'm a, I'm a I'm a boxing NBA guy, tennis too. That's my thing, I, you know. I'm kind of a borderline obsession with with these sports, you know. I ain't afraid to admit it. I love it. I love. It. I live for sports. So, um, that yeah, the reason I did this, uh, created this channel, was you know I wanted to, you know, kind of get my opinion out there and, and and you know after watching a lot of a lot of other you know great great YouTube channels. Like I say, they ain't all great. You see, and the other thing is as well, like some of these channels might have all tons of subscribers, but they you know it's it, I don't care how many subscribers a person's got. None of that means shit to me. I like good content, you know, you've got to have good content, but I know that I have a, the knowledge in the sport, you know, and uh, so I wanted to start the channel and uh, build it. It, it. it all takes time. I ain't buying subscribers either. I'm not getting into that. 
like other people do they grow their channel because they buy subscribers and it's you know they, they do that shit that ain't for me i want to legitimately build it i want people who subscribe because they want to hear my content uh you know and and that's how that's how we roll you know that's how we do things over here um so yeah yeah I, like i say i haven't made a video in a while wanted to uh you know get, get back on the grind and, and get working and you know putting these putting these videos out and uh, like i say to grow to grow my channel i enjoy doing it and uh, i love interacting when i do interact with you guys it's, it's a ton of fun you know it's a ton of fun but um yeah i do i get bored with certain channels i do i just get bored with their you know their, their bullshit you know um like i say mentioning no names and stuff but like you know some just you just get bored you you know you just come to a point where you just think you know i don't even want to listen to this guy anymore for whatever reason or this girl anymore for whatever re you know whatever reason because they, they you know they just stick to you know people just stick to stick to what they're doing leave the ego leave the egos at the door you know what i'm saying no shades drop the ego just be yourself you know what i mean they, 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 you, honestly you're a better person for it always be yourself and uh yeah that's how we roll so i'll catch you guys on the next one